hey, it's Anime Expo, let's do some window shopping. Starting at the Gundam base. You guys like Gundam 2 Freedom? Well, we got the Galgoog Menace, the Rising Freedom Gundam, the Immortal Justice Gundam, the Shiva A, and the Rudra right here. You want some Gundam based limited SDs? Well, we got them too. Hey, even a Petit Guy and some Haros. And that high grade perfectibility? They've even got a Zaku Phantom, a Rose Gundam, a Master Grade RG System Build Strike Gundam, a Master Grade Turn A Gundam, the Heavy Arms Custom EW version, an Elfreth GU, and a Tolgi's Flugel. And the Gundam base has clear colors for days. That Sazabi though. We have the real grade new Gundam, a high grade Gugu, Advance of Zeta, White Dingo, Master Grades, and this guy right here. Perfect grade unicorn. We've even got the perfect grade Unleashed and the recirculation Master Grades too. We even have the Master Grade Vercon narrative Gundam on display. The collab display was going pretty hard. I really wish they had the Nike SBs for sale because I would have scooped those up so quickly. They even had metal builds on display. And we can't forget about Requiem for Vengeance. I'm still on the fence about this guy. Leaving behind the Gundam displays, we have a good look at the Elf Village scale figures and that new Mama Tiana scale figure. I love this line so much. And this Furayu Kimono Albedo is just amazing. I wish I could afford this thing. And now we have a good look at the figureized Wing Dragon overall coming out. Oh, I love the gold on this thing right now. And wait a minute, Obelisk the Tormentor and Slifer the Sky Dragon. We getting all three, everybody. Are you guys fans of Kaiju number 8 because their scale figures are coming out as well? Based on these scale figures, I kind of want to give this anime a try, especially this gun right here. B Shoujo was celebrating their 15th anniversary and this is what they came with. There are so many different series here being represented, so if you're a fan of something very specific, they probably have a B Shoujo figure for it, including My Little Pony. But those figures I'm gonna veer away from because that's not my thing. No hate, just not my thing. Hey, we even have Hatsume Miku being represented. Speaking of Miku, we have this Taito figure of her. Also from Taito, we have Nejuri and Suyu from My Hero Academia. A sleepy Neko Miku. A bunny girl Albedo. And a sleepy Ryza. Check out these official prints from Bleach. Also, here's a look at the Pail Duran model kit. We've even got Hololive on stage. There's this beauty whose name I can't remember right now. I can't remember this one's name either, but still cute. This altar. Fate Grand Order Lancer Artoria. I need this so bad. We've got power in the house. Hey, it's Kana. Card Captain Sakura for the win. Zoids, 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 and more Zoids. Got Armor Core here and here. Don't know what you are, 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 but you're still really, really cool. Also, you're really cool too. Prototypes of some new hotness. Mecha Miku. This thing, this thing, this thing, Centaur. And loads of noodle toppers for your ramen. Including Mitsuri, Rengoku, Miku, this demon Miku, Kitagawa Marin, Free Ren Power, and Chainsaw Man. Her name escapes me, but it's really, really cool. This beautiful thing too. We've got this $70 Desire Driver alongside this $500 original Kamen Rider Driver. <laughs> Jesus Christ. We've got various Ultraman Rising merch. Aw, oh, look at that tiny Emmy. And ooh, this is quite a bit here. And ooh, wait, oh, big Ultraman up top. Oh my god, it's Emmy! Oh my god, look at her, she's so adorable. And also, 